Charlie Webster was put into a medically induced coma after she was diagnosed with a rare strain of malaria during the Rio Olympics and now she has opened up about the terrifying moment she was told she was dying. The television presenter contracted the disease when she headed to the Games last month after cycling to Rio on a six-week, 3,000-mile trek to raise money. Doctors initially thought she had a bacterial infection and told the 33-year-old, we don't know what is wrong yet. But we need you to know that you are dying. Speaking about her traumatic ordeal as doctors struggled to work out what was causing her organs to fail, Charlie recalled, blood was coming out of every part of my body. I was just curled up and in so much pain. It's hard to describe. I felt like my body was imploding from inside and it was. My organs were pushing against my skin and the doctors didn't know what was wrong. I panicked quite a lot and I fought them letting me go to sleep because I was so scared that if I shut my eyes I would die. The presenter revealed that she felt she was moments from death as she battled with the disease and even had a conversation with death. Charlie told the son, I just saw myself and we were in this black space and we weren't people, we were just an energy. Death said to me, come on. You've got to go. I actually said yes to start with, like I'm happy to die because I just couldn't do it anymore. There's no words to describe how much pain I was in. I feel awful as I wanted to die and remember being happy with what I've done with my life. However, Charlie instead decided to fight to survive and is now back at home following her incredible battle with malaria. Doctors have called her recovery remarkable but she admitted she is paranoid the infection will creep up again. She is continuing, her recovery is an outpatient at St. James Hospital in Leeds and hopes to return to presenting by the end of the year. Watch more videos at video.fivelar.net.